Okay, welcome everyone. Now that you're in, into the Scarnsey Hollenbeck community, let's get started. At its core, this, uh, the community is a way to communicate with coworkers. And to communicate with a coworker, you navigate to the top of the screen and type in the name of the person you would like to communicate with. In this instance, I want to communicate with Peter Muller. Hello, Pete. If I want to communicate with more than one person at a time, I click up, go to the nav, top of the screen and click on the pencil icon. There, I can type in the names of the people I want to message in a group. Peter and Chip. Oh, guys, I have an important document for you. Okay, I said that because in groups and in individual chats, you have the ability to share files with uh, the person you want to communicate with. To do so, you click on files. Then drag the file you want to share into the screen. In this case, I've already added it, so I just want to replace it to keep things moving. It's loading right now. And I click back to the chat and my document was shared. Now this makes this is great for sharing important information back and forth between coworkers um, and collaborate on those documents. So these chats are completely private. If you'd like to broadcast a, a message to the entire firm, we have the ability to do so. If you click on Teams over here, you'll see Scarnsey Hollenbeck Community. I've created all these different channels so you can create specific messages to go to specific uh, areas of the firm. In this case, I wanna make an announcement to the entire firm. Hello, everyone. Now, my message will be seen by everybody in the entire firm. As you can see, as I've been talking, I've been getting messages from Peter and Chip. You'll be alerted of their messages in the corner of your screen. The last thing I want to show you is say you want to create your own team. You have the ability to do so. And the reason why you would do this is if you want to have private group messages uh, that have a has varying complexity. So here you can create a team, build a team from scratch, make it private, test team number two. As you can see, I already made a test team. It's going to create the team for me. Thank you. And then I want to add a member. Add. And then I want to close. And then from here, you can actually, if you right click on team two, you can add a new channel. Announcements. And now anybody in test team two can have access to these channels and you can have a private, more broader, more complex conversation. Now that's it for this video. The next video, I'll show you some more advanced features of Microsoft Teams. Thank you.